You cannot believe how excited I was to go to London, and it was actually hubby's first time to England, so that was special too. Plus, we actually had some pretty beautiful things planned. And if we're going to England, of course I have to read something like this. On our way to the hotel, we had to stop at Paddington Station, and that's kind of like a childhood memory, even though I wasn't there, but because of the books and stories and all, you know, I was pretty excited about that. The first thing we did on our first day was go to Sky Garden and the view, the view was amazing. Just seeing the whole city from such a high place it was mesmerizing, especially because we were inside a garden on such a high place. After that, we went to dinner, and guys, we went to the Savoy, and that wasn't planned at all, that was more a spontaneous thing, but I don't regret anything because the experience was so amazing. We had no idea what the menu was, so every dish was a surprise, and it was so good. It wasn't heavy, even though it was a nine-course meal, you know? but. Everything was so fresh and refreshing, and you didn't actually feel that you were eating so much. But I must admit, at dessert, I was stuffed. I couldn't eat another bite. But it was such a great experience. The next day we went to the Ritz! I was so excited about the Ritz because I mean it's the Ritz! And we finally got to go there. It was everything I hoped for. The ambiance was beautiful, the food was delicious, the service was so kind. I'd love to go back. It was, it was a dream come true.
then, of course, we had to go see the Buckingham Palace. I mean, who would go to London and not see Buckingham Palace? At Gong, and this was also like Sky Garden, very high and classy, and the food was an Asian fusion style, I'd say. It was delicious, and well, what can I say about the view? We love high places. We like beautiful views. Who doesn't? And it was also an amazing experience. This was actually Hubby's idea. I had no idea about this this place, but he's seen it in, on YouTube, and I'm I'm glad he did. of a touristy day we went back to Sky Garden in Fenchurch and this restaurant was modern, classy and kind of exotic if you will. this too because we had a reservation at Fortnum and Mason and of course of course this had to be special the store the Turkish delight which I had to buy of course the teas everything it was so special
classy British tea time. I've actually never had that, I think. So that was really nice. Of course, we cannot leave London without seeing Big Ben. So, even though it was raining, of course, we stopped by. And also, we could not leave England without even having fish and chips. So, at the airport, here we are having fish and chips. short but beautiful trip and we are excited to go to London sometime again.